Uh, so hello students, how are you? So today we will discuss about the job update. Uh, we will discuss about the March 24 uh, and this is the part one, fine. Yeah, so we will discuss what are the jobs right now in the market for the VLSI. So let's see, I am searching VLSI. I'm going to the jobs. Mm. Dated past one week. Okay, experience label is internship. We are focusing on the uh, freshers only mainly. Yeah. So my first job is Cadence Validation Engineer Two. This is for entry level, and what they are expecting is they have not mentioned the job description as such. So if you want to apply you can go for this job similarly this is again almost the same yeah in this they have discussed the job responsibility one year of experience is minimum needed this is for the back end physical design since this is placement route sta so this is for the physical design mainly you have the knowledge of the tool also and the like since this is sta all these things this session test qualified yeah minimum one year of experience is needed for the engineer too Validation engineer too. Yeah. EDA. So this is the this is the EDA workflow optimization engineer NVIDIA. So what they are expecting is okay. What they are expecting is uh, minimum two year of experience uh, with a BTEC or MTEC degree uh, and so ST, ASIC design flow, EDA tools, uh, Linux, okay, all these things are required to work out from the cloud. C++ knowledge and the Python will be preferred, uh, knowledge of the GPU is preferred. Mm. Okay, experience with the IT background will be also preferred. If you have the IT background uh, before the MTech call like uh, recently, then you can apply for this thing and mention the resume also. Yeah, communication and skills, all these things. Okay, what are the expectations? Okay, okay, you will be working all, this is all about the job. Yeah. Uh, then Ampere. So it is design plus verification engineer. How much they are expecting is minimum two years of experience. They are expecting uh, system LO, UVM, VSDL, uh, system LO, UVM projects are there. Uh, C++, Python, all these things are required. Even AMBA protocols knowledge, NOC, network concept design verification will be preferred. Uh, ARM knowledge is preferred. Uh, assembly language programming, hands-on, experience in post silicon validation all these things are required for this position yeah this is a good company you can apply a staff engineer micron so what they are expecting is they have not mentioned it is the entry level so but it is a staff so if you want to apply for this company you can apply it is for design plus verification means system allow uvm print and vlsi this is the same job i guess this is for bangalore position this is for pune position same job almost here yeah. yeah creating test bench generating facility random test benches debugging create coverage monitors uh, lead verification engineer okay minimum two years of experience they are expecting okay fine uh, then we are going to the arm uh, design plus verification engineer so minimum how much they are expecting is entry level no no CPU library test. So these are the skills that are required. They have not mentioned the year of experience. So verification plan, safety documentation as per the in the collaboration with all these things. Uh, helping building soft diagnostics software. Uh, basically, it is design plus verification with the knowledge of CPU and the computer architecture and the programming. Yeah. So you can apply for this thing. 
Hmm. Even computer science background people can apply for for this because this is more oriented towards programming. Uh, these are the requirements actually. C programming assembly language. Uh, explore to willing the okay okay okay. Uh, even Python language is preferred. See one scripting language is preferred either TCL, Perl, Python. At least one language you should do, learn with the Linux also and the what is your course work like physical design or the front end VLSI or whatever the course you are taking according to it because these are very very important it is mentioned in the like bottom also but these are important if you are having one more skills now obviously you will be taking the advantage who don't know the python or the Perl or tcl uh, then physical design engineer ram Dix, he is the co-founder okay he is hiring oh. Yeah, year of experience they are expecting is full time. Okay, though they have not mentioned the year of experience, so you can if you have the skills like uh, like even the internship certificates, internship uh, experience you can apply and you can directly contact him. Message option is also available. Like you can directly message him or. <coughs> Also, easy apply. You can upload the resume here. <coughs> uh, now we have the staff. Staff engineer, design verification engineer. So yeah. So let's see what what they are expecting is. So staff engineer minimum one year associate level. So minimum one year not two year of experience they are expecting, right? System around UVM, right? All these things they are expecting is, mm, yeah. If you have a minimum one year of experience, then you can apply for the this uh, position. Uh, then chip power obtention engineer. It is entry level, but they are expecting some yeah two year of experience in the power obtention, estimation and obtention techniques. See, if you are the like, let's say verification engineer experience of two years and you don't know about the power of tension techniques, at least before applying, just learn these techniques, right? At least the basics, learn from the, like, let's say some of your friend is working in the power of tension. You can ask them what are the skills needed for this thing. And these are like seven eight techniques you can go through the theory part at least. And after that, you can learn the practical implementation from your some of the friend. You just take the idea, right? If you are ideally applying and they are expecting in the interview that they sh you should know the basics, obviously you are wasting your time also as well as their time, right? So at least go through the job decision before applying. That is very, very important. Uh, NVIDIA design. Uh, design verification infrastructure engineer minimum two year of experience they are expecting uh, all these are the skills like system hello UPM Py, python Perl, uh, eda tools knowledge uh, experience with lfl L, lsf compute compute farms fil filters networks experience with setups when okay these are the like some advanced things they are expecting but two years of experience they are expecting, right? Yeah, this is for the infrastructure part. Okay. So if you are interested, then go for this job. Hmm. But before applying, you should know the system or UVM. Plus take some uh, knowledge of these things also, right? From internet or some, some of the friends or whatever it is, right? But you should know the basics to knowledge of like what is this, right? Background in the professional origin control system, continuous integration. At least you should know the basics of these things, right? Okay, National Research Fellowship. Okay, this is also good opportunity because you are getting a step in there, right? So these are the things they are expecting like if you are from the BTEC background with a GATE score and RAMTEC or 60% or 6.5 CGPA, knowledge of digital electronics, very low VSDL and having all the FPGA basics on board knowledge, right? 
so these are the simple thing and you will be getting stipend here right so this is good so analog layout tech mahindra so you can directly contact the hr uh, she have mentioned the id also yeah so this is for layout full time uh, they have not mentioned the year of experience so easy apply is also there you can upload the resume even the fresher can apply then memory layout design engineer so these are the skills design layout design circuit design analog circuits experience in physical verification uh, basic knowledge of drc lbs uh, experience in the fuel planning routing uh, familiarity with the tools industry tools and methodologies methodologies mm, problem solving skills all these things b tech all these things are like basics only you pressure can apply for this profile memory layout memory layout yeah physical design engineer mm, wipro you can directly contact the hr minimum 5 year expect expect in they are x 5 year of experience can apply mm, or if you are expecting that you can directly contact the hr and ask her like let's say you have the 2 year of experience or 3 year of experience then you can also directly contact the hr and apply fine right? mm, then graduate technical engineer intern technical intern so yeah let's see what they are expecting is i think anyone can apply only the year of year of passing out will matter i guess 24 it will be i guess 24 so yeah you can apply for the intel but apply for the through the referral only like senior referral fine <clears throat> so both are similar only yeah these are same apply from the job portal with the referral then we have cad cad ed automation engineer so this is the profile of hr you can directly contact her uh, so minimum 2 year experience experience in vlsi uh, they are expecting so it is for the automation engineer so scripting language are very very important for this role even the tone knowledge is important so yeah <laughs> scripting language perl tcl shell xml yaml SQL database, Apache, HTML, all these things are required. And any five of these skills, of these like almost ten skills, right? Mm. Two years of experience in the VLSI. So let's say you are working in the IT field with the automation skills, and recently you are looking for the switching the purpose of the you have taken the training or like M Tech, then these skills, automation skills, will be useful here also. Fine. oh physical design engineer so you can directly contact the management manager he is hiring so it is for physical design so uh, yeah one year of experience if you have the uh, like experience of internship of one year like travel month then you can directly contact the uh, some of the employer or you can directly contact the manager and you can apply fine Mm. Um, this is for not for it is for HR position, so this is not relevant. But if you want to apply for the like management skills and you are not like some issues are coming in the job, so you can contact for the HR position if you want to apply. So physical design verific, physical design engineer. So how much they are expecting is one year of experience, almost the same job what we have discussed earlier. Uh, these are the skills like layouts, uh, verification, STA, EMI, I, IR drop. <coughs> Even layout people with a like little bit physical design uh, knowledge, they can apply for this job. All it is almost like seems to be similar. Like layout, verification, LBS, all these things are there. Minimum one year of experience they are expecting in the physical design. Uh, routing place since CTS timing. Cover, coverage, a uh, layout closure, uh, strong knowledge in the uh, standard place, place and route flow, uh, knowledge of I two ICC two, 
synopsis, you know, was good knowledge of the Python, TCL, all these things are needed. Yeah. Then product validation engineer. So, so she is hiring. So let's see. Okay, this is not for VLSI, but if you are from electronics and you are like fine with these skills and uh, just know more about the this this company on all these things. This is, but this is not for VLSI, right? But if you want to apply, then you can apply for this. Like uh, this is for safety, safety. All these things are there, but this is not for VLSI. But electronics students are eligible for this. Then analog layout design engineer, the pro. You can directly contact the HR. And uh, minimum experience they are expecting is they have not mentioned. Yeah, they have not mentioned. Uh, yeah, so experience in the Intel PDK, uh, Global Foundry PDK, TCL PDK are acceptable, except accepted. Mm, design of uh, band gaps, temperature sensor, PLL, GPIOs, other layout blocks, analog layout blocks. Uh, design of SED, SER, DES, CDX blocks uh, like transistor, receivers, equalizers, all these things are needed. So this is for lay layout. Uh, if you have like pressure also and you have the knowledge of these things, but experience is also needed in this. So minimum one year of experience, let's say one year of experience can apply. So now we will see aesthetic design micro code engineer so this is for rtl design engineer so you can directly contact the hr uh, and uh, you can directly apply, apply through the portal they have not mentioned much about the job here this is for entry level rtl design engineer even if you are applying for this thing you should know the basic knowledge of cdc lint because these are the skills for RTL design only, CDC and all, right? Linting, all these things, right? Staff layout engineer, entry label. Yeah, in this they have mentioned all these things, right? So these are the skills for the layout. Yeah. So, so it is for entry label, but uh, it is for a staff position, minimum one year of experience is needed. So at least one year of experience or the internship experience is needed for this job. Fine. Going to the second page. Hmm. Cadence. Cadence validation engineer. It is almost the same as what we have checked on the last page. Uh, Validation of the DFT technologies such as 1500 wrappers, com compressors, uh, all these things hierarchy test, L-based OPCG using cadence tool, all these things are ATPG knowledge is also important, create test, test plans, <coughs> collaborations with the teams, debugging skills, uh, all these things are needed, minimum two year of experience they are expecting, even <coughs> Knowledge of very low digital electronics scripting language is needed, even DFT part. So if you have the DFT experience and some automation engineer, uh, like automation scripting language uh, knowledge, then this is for you. This is for the basically for the DFT engineers. Although they have mentioned as a validation engineer, but from the job description, you can clearly see this is for the DFT engineer. Even Basics knowledge of physical design is expected and the Python Pal, all these things are needed. Fine. So just refer the job description and apply for it. Right. Analog layout design engineer. So this is again same HR, same job description is there. So you can directly contact the HR and discuss. Her ID will be also mentioned in, in her account. You can directly see. So again, see cadence. Yeah, <clears throat> here the job description is different. Minimum two year of experience they are expecting. So, position description, machine learn 
learning driven design a flow optimization cadence sign off okay sign off group okay mm. so basic so knowledge of physical design synthesis scripting language polyntical shell and some automation knowledge <coughs> like machine learning and auto algorithm will be plus right <coughs> basically before applying for this position learn basics of machine learning and some of the algorithm right optimization techniques and all right design optimization techniques if you have the experience in this field you must be knowing like what are the optimization techniques or you can contact some of the friends of some other companies and some of the seniors so that they can share some document for this for this thing right machine learning power optimization techniques right not power design optimization techniques yeah minimum to of experience, experience they are expecting now broadcom design and verification engineer mm, he is hiring for the broadcom you can directly contact him even you can directly message him uh, these are the knowledge knowledge of the functional verification debugging skills uh, experience in the rtl design uh, integration skills a strong understanding of rtl coding and architecture problem solving skills uh, verbal skills yeah these are the basic skills they are expecting basically system about uvm and the basic skills like functional verification and debugging skills integration is also important in this yeah so even computer science experience can apply but they are expecting 8 year of experience in for this position no 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 requirement added by the post okay they are expecting like huge experience but if you want to apply just directly contact the sir and he will guide you fine <sighs> memory circuit design engineer again wipro and same hr uh, bit cell sensor amplifier clock tree control logic design uh, then reliability emri uh, then all these things are needed basically these are for memory circuits right even the tool knowledge is important <coughs> uh, now verification engineer hardware perf uh, performance monitor so for the mtech they are expecting 2 year of experience for the btech they are expecting 3 year of experience what does the skill set is needed we will go from below the communication skills uvm uh, then verilog then verification uh, knowledge of the tool like vcs all these things are needed uh, then debugging skills scripting language like uh, like python python is important right nowadays even perl is important mm. then experience in the creating test benches then unit level subsystem level soc level verification experience yeah these are the skills needed then next is fpga profile fpga engineer so you can directly contact the this person uh, so this seems to be a good company because no i don't know about this company much Okay, this is like a startup only, like only 10 to 15 employees, 15, 25 employees are there. You can directly, but this is for FPGA, so this is good for starting. Even location is Surat, right? Gujarat people can apply, other people can also apply. You can directly contact the HR and easy apply. You can upload the resume, right? Hardware engineer, again from Ahmedabad, Gujarat. So, co founder is hiring. So oh, let's see what they are expecting is diploma people can apply but this not for VLSI right so if you are from electronics background from diploma then you can apply for this position fine analog layout pressures uh, DGCOM 
सो दीज आर दिल सीमोस बाई सीमोस एस ओ आई इनफेक्ट प्रोसेस बेसिकली द प्रोसेस फॉर द फेब्रिकेशन एंड ऑल यू शुड नो द एटलीस्ट थ्योरी एंड हाउ मच दे आर एक्सपेक्टिंग इज प्रेशर ट्रेंड फ्रेशर ओके दिस इज ग्रेट देन यू कैन अप्लाई फॉर द डी जी कॉम एन लोग ले आउट इंजीनियर्स तो इफ यू हैव दन द ट्रेनिंग और विदाउट द ट्रेनिंग ऑल्सो बट बिफोर अप्लाइंग जस्ट गो थ्रू दिस स्किल्स डेट इज इंपॉर्टेंट जस्ट राइट डाउन ऑन द पेन एंड पेपर एंड ओपन द यूट्यूब और लाइक गूगल just for every topic just go go through 3 4 hours 4 5 hours what according to the time you have fine but these are the skills they will be expecting in the interview other than this also they will expect the basics and of analog layout uh then soc silicon design engineer this is for artil design yeah uh cdc lint Uh, spy glass knowledge they are expecting ability to debug experience with a synopsis design compiler all these things they are expecting and mm, they have mentioned a year of experiences entry level so you can apply for this company uh, this is for a consultancy they are looking for pv physical design verification engineer hyderabad is the location 0 to 3 year of experience so we will see some more jobs vls are hiring uh, some latest jobs we are we will see yeah mm, latest uh, so he is hiring for like uh, this seems to be consultancy yeah our consultancy fees for all the level is he is hiring but i i don't think you can apply for this thing because he will going to take some fees also so he is also hiring this is for experience minimum 6 6 year of experience they are expecting and these are the skills they are expecting pci ddr for ethernet and system allo uvm very low test bench ip and ssc verification engineer you can directly mail to him okay uh, yeah this is for you uh, this is some startup a smart chip design bangalore you can apply if you are the fresher but i don't like much know about this company much uh, this is also hiring uh, okay he is hiring for multiple jobs fine multiple locations uh, you can directly mail to him we are hiring okay you are stop hiring okay okay some job is there you can apply for this thing also if you want but read the job description clearly before applying anywhere that is important or uh so basically these are the jobs for this week uh, we are not getting much relevant jobs uh, here you can follow me on the linkedin uh we will, i will going to post some more jobs so from there you can like directly apply fine i will sh share the link also like uh, how you can directly like apply right so just just you can apply directly yeah if you have any query you can directly contact us through the website uh, uh we lsi for all website is there basically dot in website is for the uh, if you want to give the some test series you can join our free free courses also we are giving some free vlsa courses in the application you can directly download the vlsa for lab uh, after downloading the application you will get the like free courses uh, like this free test series and some free free vlsa interview free vlsa courses you can click directly in the application Uh, these are some free free courses we are giving you can see like uh, right now we have eight free courses like these are the vlsa for beginners uh, sta course free sta course free master classes some of the demo sessions we have demo classes uh, youtube like uh, live sessions we give through this mm, this is for like digital electronics 
interviews question uh, this is for very long quiz and this is a very long free course fine you can like go to the free course after completing the free course you can go for premium courses premium vlsi courses these are some of the premium vlsi courses almost like 20 courses we have no right now we have 16 uh, we will update it to web in the website and right now we have the 20 courses right uh, you can see rtl and a verification code this is our best course mm. we are giving some extra validity also it is not like that 180 days uh, two three months extra validity we are giving free of the course physical design verification <coughs> advanced dft course advanced analog layout course even recently we have the launch of advanced verification uh, sorry advanced analog design course uh, referral program it is for the back end referral program for the front end uh, this is rtl ninja course uh, this is advanced star verification course this is st course static time assist 5000 rupees only uh, uvm classes uh, some TCL classes, Perl classes, then Linux and Unix classes, master classes, then this is free of the course interview guidance program. Um, this is again star verification, but this is for the basics level and this is for the company who want to recruit through us. Fine. So <clears throat> you can directly contact on this WhatsApp number or you can write a mail to us. FAQs, everything is there. You can download the VLSI for all application from here. Mm, Apple users, Play Store Android users and Windows users. For the Windows, you have to download from here itself. Fine. There is no other link for the Windows, right? <clears throat> no. Going to the dot com website. In the dot com website, we will see like uh, I guess this is under maintenance right now. It is not opening. Or you can directly contact through the LinkedIn page. This is our LinkedIn page. You can directly contact through the LinkedIn page. Uh, there is two website dot com and dot in both, both website uh, belongs to the VLSI for all, all only you can directly contact through the message or so, like contact us yeah if you have any doubt or query you can directly contact us or you can download the play store application uh, sorry from the play store you can download our app VLSI for all application uh, almost 9000 downloads we have uh, yeah, it is accessible for all the countries. Uh, yeah, one more thing if you are not getting the OTP, uh, some of the international students are not getting the OTP because of the server issue, then you can write the mail ID. You can write your mail ID. You have to write the three things basically name, mail ID, mobile number. Well, write these three things and uh, just WhatsApp to the 9643 070 368. Or you can write a mail to us info at the rate vlsi for all uh, dot com. So you can uh, drop a mail. We will uh, from the backend, we will give you the OTP. Fine. Anything else? If you have anything else, just contact us through the WhatsApp and all. Yeah. Thank you so much. Have a nice day. Bye. Take care.